Alright guys, now today we have a video that is definitely a little bit important in SML and it's definitely a video that I actually didn't plan to make at all and I only realized it until I actually, you know, yesterday I sat in bed, I was thinking about like, I was just thinking about SML, right? And I was thinking like, it doesn't actually seem like Logan is that much invested in SML anymore and I don't know what that means for the rest of us who watch the content uh but I i'm gonna explain myself but it just doesn't seem like logan is actually interested in making sml videos anymore and i think if you were to ask him if he could make other videos on youtube i think he would say something else and i don't particularly know what exactly to think about this situation um, it's definitely not a good video, so it, it, this isn't the most happy video of all time. It's definitely not a sad one by any means, like we're not talking about anybody's death or anything like that, but, you know, we're just, uh, we're just chilling and, uh, talking about this main stuff. So, uh, yeah, um, that is basically what this video is gonna be about. So, if you guys are gonna go on to enjoy, please drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated, as always. Like, really? And, uh, without further ado, guys, I mean, tomorrow I've got a Banger Theory video coming out. It's gonna be a great one, um, and I think you guys are gonna love it. But, without further ado, guys, let's get right on to it. So, we have to talk about Logan and essentially what has happened in the last couple days. Now, in the last couple days, we have seen that Logan has, his schedule of posting has been a little bit bad. Now, he says... Typically, it's two to three videos a week, which it does make sense, and he does stay true to that to that schedule. This week, he barely posted three. Last week, he posted two. Like, again, it's it's just all that, and it makes sense. But I just feel like the schedule, the, the, the video schedule, has been kind of long. I mean, it took him four days to make a new video, and... Um, it, it's not like I'm concerned about that in particular. I'm just not exactly sure what to expect. So, for example, right, um, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, uh, it feels like Logan doesn't really love coming up with, like, I guess, newer ideas like he used to. So, in the past, what he would do is he would actually make these very inventive and creative videos for the most part. That would be unlike things we have seen before. Like, for example, you know, you had videos where Jeffy went in a submarine and all that. Or, well, not Jeffy, but it was, um, I think it was Mario and Brooklyn T guy. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, that went inside a submarine, right? And all the way into the deep waters. Like, it's videos like those that were so good in the past. But now, you know, we're not getting those videos anymore, and it just makes me concerned as to whether Logan actually still... Okay, he still cares about his videos, and to anyone who says he doesn't care about his videos, is just wrong, because he does. He cares about his videos, he cares about his community. But it looks like every, almost every video is just taking inspiration off stuff that's happening in real life. Like... In 2022 alone, we've had the retirement, which was based on Tom Brady's retirement. We had um, Cody's NFT, which was based on an NFT. We had Jeffy Ball Z, which was based on Dragon Ball Z. We had the Pool Shark, which is based on Pool Sharks in real life. Um, so yeah, it just, um, it, it really, like, a lot of the videos are just right now, they're just very, I, I don't want to say... Like, they're, they're just very uh, in, inspired off of what happens in real life. And that makes me worried that he's running out of ideas. Um, typically, when that happens, um, you know, usually you would see more. But in this case, you know, you can't really justify, you know, the fact that he is actually making all these different videos that are based on real events. Because if he had the video ideas, he probably wouldn't do something like Cody's NFT or Jeffy Ball Z. Again, nothing wrong with it. I'm just a bit concerned. Um, you look at videos like Jeffy Fixes Death, which is the most recent one that came out. Um, and the thing is, he is also using, uh, I think it's Nintendo. Don't remember. Uh, basically, there's this guy that makes animations for them uh, occasionally. Well, he just makes SML animations, right? Uh, and you'll see them in the videos, right? But the thing is, is that with these animations, you know, people are saying it's nice that he's using content from other creators to help make his videos, 
But I'm actually concerned that maybe he just doesn't want to record any extra things for the video because he definitely could have recorded it himself or he, you know, maybe it was out of pure, you know, pure goodness that he wanted to use Nintendo's things and use it in the video. And I think if that's the case, that's great. But if it's genuinely for a secret motive that people don't really know about, then I think that that's where the problems really start to arise is that you don't really know the motives behind what he's doing. Now, is it fair to assume that he's running out of ideas and he's not, you know, he's not feeling it anymore? No, it's not, okay? It's not good to judge anybody. But I want to throw this out there to you guys. Not only this, keep in mind that imagine how it is now, you know, when the baby comes out, I, I, I okay, I'm making it sound like a freaking video game, like, oh, when the baby comes out, no. Okay, when Logan and Chili give birth to this baby, right? What's going to happen is, is that all the people, or all the SML crew actually, and Logan, are going to be severely affected. The videos are going to be less and less prevalent. We're probably going to see one video a week, or two videos, it's going to go from two to three videos a week, to one to two videos a week. And that is going to be a tough thing for SML fans. Um, again, I think the remakes were just a staple of him, you know just wanting to reuse his previous content which i think is fine but uh well not fine but again it's not amazing but uh he stopped doing that which i think is great um but again he's just looking so much at what's happening right now and it makes me a little bit concerned because in previous years we would only see videos that were based on holidays and not exactly real life events like for example we had jeffy plays football um all in the span of a couple months by the way Hold on, so Jeffy plays football, we had um, Squid Game, which again was obvious, I mean they made one for Among Us, they're going to make one for Squid Game, no question about it. Um, no Nut November was based on obviously No Nut November, um, and then it just like kept on going, you know. Uh, Brooklyn Tea Guys Thanksgiving, again that's Thanksgiving, that's totally fine, they always make one every year, not going to complain about that. Um, but again... They didn't need to make an Elf on the Shelf video and a Christmas Problem video and a Jeffy X Gucci Xbox video. Those are three Christmas videos. Don't get me wrong. I'm not complaining. The more the merrier, my friend. But again, that's just how that's just how it is. And then of course the Pool Shark, Jeffy Ball Z, Cody's NFT, um, and the retirement. Now again, to anybody saying that I am being bad about this and that I am, you know, being rude or anything like that. I'm not being rude. I'm just giving out a genuine, like, explanation for what has been going on in SML because I don't actually think that anything great has, you know, uh, been going on lately. However, you know, it does make me concerned because if this is the route that we're heading in and the fact that we might only be seeing one or two videos... I just hope Logan doesn't change his entire channel because we've seen people do that before and it would make me really sad. Um, it really would. You know what? Like, if SML were to do that, I'd probably have to make my own plush video. But, um, yeah. Anyway, uh, I think that that's it. I honestly do. Uh, but, again, you know, obviously, I just want to say that I could never make videos as good as Logan's if I am on the outside and if I'm actually... Uh, not, uh, you know, making my own videos that are puppet related because I know that they are difficult, but I don't really have a crew or anything like that. Um, but again, that is the video. Uh, but yeah, um, look, do I think Logan is going to, you know, be part of SML and really like thrive it out? I think this year could be the end. I really do because mixed with an unpleasurably like feeling, you know, and mixed with, like, unsatisfaction of making videos, plus, you know, the the arrival of the new baby, that is going to put a lot of things into question. And I just, I don't really know what's going to happen. I really want you guys to comment down below what you think is going to happen SML in 2022, because I'm definitely a little bit concerned. Um, and, you know, obviously, if SML does go out, then I don't know what I do either. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys.